Prevention People's Party, CPP, is advocating for the restoration of Dr. Kwame Nkrumah's seven-year development plan. At a news conference in Accra, the party leadership said the plan would have put Ghana ahead of most Western countries if Dr. Nkrumah had not been overthrown in 1966. Exactly 51 years ago, Ghana's first president, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah, was overthrown. The Convention People's Party leadership believes the overthrow also truncated Ghana's development process. The party's chairman, Professor Edmond Deli, says Ghana would have been ahead of most Western nations if Dr. Nkrumah had not been overthrown. Malaysia, Singapore, they came and learned from us. They took the development plan. And where are they now? They are palm oil, they use our palm oil to develop. And we are now sitting down, still begging people to come and teach us how to industrialize. In there. The party's patron, Bafo Kwamina Setre, said there is the need for Ghana to revisit Dr. Kwame Nkrumah's seven year development plan. The plan aims at bringing Ghana to the threshold of a modern state based on a highly organized and efficient agricultural and industrial program. Since we were overthrown, the jute factory has not been revived. And we import jute bags for our cocoa from Pakistan and Bangladesh. Since 66 up to today, it has not been revived. And we will talk of unemployment. CPP former presidential aspirant Bright Akwete said the CPP would reorganize to re power in the coming years. Those who came later to confuse us and claim falsely that they are CPP, they just an aberration. They just came to muddy the waters. The time is up. The CPP will come back, reorganize itself, and you will see that you'll be proud to call yourself a Ghanaian again. In the name of great CPP.